Bob, what happens in the time leading up to a closing from the seller's perspective? Well, from the seller's perspective, there isn't really a lot that they have to do. They're probably already supplied their own attorney with information about their own mortgage that has to be paid off, uh, whether or not there have been any parking tickets that have to be be satisfied or dirty sidewalk summonses that have to be satisfied at closing. The primary responsibility of the seller is to is to make their house broom clean and vacant and move out so that when the seller comes in to do their final inspection before the closing, the, the buyer hopefully will see a property that's in a similar uh, manner that they remember it when they first made the offer several months ago. So for the seller, there's really not a heck of a lot for them to do except pack up and get out.